Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and today's video is going to be about reverse engraving. Reverse engraving is where you, in, you engrave everything away and the letters stay out with the wood. So there's two ways to do this. The way I normally do it, I would click on my text, go up and put no fill, put a red hairline, and then I would go to the uh, Smart Fill tool, set it on black, and I would fill this in. Now this is still white, but you can move it away and we'll bring in our yellow box. Whoop. We'll bring in a yellow box, color it with yellow, put it to the back of the page, move it over. So now your the word text is not engraved at all, but everything else is engraved out. So the other way you can do that, let me grab my yellow box out of the way, is to take this and let's turn this text, well I'll tell you what, let's move it down three inches. Let's turn it white just so we can see it. Let's make this black. Let's take our text and put it back. But as you can see, it's still white, so it would engrave. But then you could select both these, go up to the Weld tool and hit Simplify. And what Simplify done, did is take the text out. So we can just delete that and bring in your box. And now everything is the same. Now, it did put a red hairline around it. So you'd want to click and go no, no outline. But this, so you get the same result in both cases, but Simplify will fill in every little so if you had a bunch of text and you had a bunch of inward circles or inward enclosures the simplify would be a little faster anyway i hope that helps a little bit and thank you for watching